Hey guys, Technomentary here with a video for you guys to show you guys how to quickly share large videos and even lots of photos between two iPhones. So if iPhone is nearby or if you're near them and you know you want to share some videos and photos and don't want to send them through text or email because they usually take longer and there's a limit on those. There's a cool built-in option between iPhones known as AirDrop. So what this does is allows you to send kind of pictures and videos through the Wi-Fi using what's known as AirDrop, but you do have to go and turn that on and you have to be connected on the same Wi-Fi so it can do peer-to-peer uh, um, -peer sharing. So we'll show you guys how to do it. So here I have an iPhone 8 and an iPhone 7, and we're gonna go ahead and show you guys how I can quickly send a bunch of photos to the other one phone to another. So right now I'm connected on the same network. So you do have to be connected on the same Wi-Fi for this to work. And then in the settings, you have to see if you're set up to share um, AirDrop options. So we'll go into settings. And then once your settings, go to general and then click on AirDrop on both of your devices. And as you can see, by default, these are only receiving. Um, so there's a couple options for AirDrop. You can only either receive or send um, to your contacts only, or if you select everyone, that will allow anyone to send you stuff, but then when someone sends it to you or you send it to them, they still have to accept. So we're gonna go ahead and select everyone for this purposes, or if you wanna do strictly like between your friends or family, your contacts, I would select that option for the most um, security. So let's go ahead and show you guys how that's done. So once you, um, select one of the options to do airdrop. Simply go to your photos uh, or videos that you want to share. So I here, as you can see, I have about 16 photos that I want to send over to this phone. I'll show you how quickly the other phone gets these phones. So we're going to go ahead and select all the photos here. So I'm selecting all 16 photos here. And then you want to hit the option button. And once you hit the option button, you'll see there's... Uh, other phones nearby that is connected to this network. So the, the so this iPhone 8 that I have um, is the iPhone. So I'm gonna select iPhone. Once I select iPhone, I should see a pop-up. See, here's a pop-up of saying that there's 16 photos that are being airdropped. To, I can decline it or accept it. If I accept it, um, it will start sending. As you can see here, it's sent it already. And now if I open up, photos here it opens up the photo app actually right away and shows us all these photos that were just airdropped to us and that took about a second or two whereas if you're sending on mail or even through message or iMessage it usually sometimes there's a lag because there's so many photos and this works even well if you have videos as well as long as the devices are nearby so hopefully this video helped you guys kind of understand what airdrop is and how to take advantage of this simple simple tool to kind of share photos and videos between your friends and family um thanks for watching guys and make sure to hit the like and subscribe button see you guys next time